that he would not defile himself yeah. with the portion of the king meat. Yes. As to that which which he drank, therefore he requested of the of the prince of the eunuch that he might not defile himself. Uh -huh. So he told the king that he did not want to eat the king's meat. He wanted to eat, he wanted to eat vegetables and drink water. That way he he can keep his mind clear to understand what the Lord is saying to him. Not eat all this other stuff that the, that the, he was that was given him. Not the king's meat, which was the, wasn't right. So he wanted to keep his mind clear so he can hear God and you know obey God. And he did. He kept his mind on God. He didn't didn't take his mind off God at one time. The king wanted him to bow to this image. He did not do it. He refused to bow. The king wanted to, you know, change him around, but he didn't do it. He tried his best, but he couldn't do it because Daniel was well favored with God. Oh, so do you want to be well favored with God? Do you want to have faith with God? If you want to have faith with God, you got to do what God say do. Yeah. We got to obey God in order to have favor. Yes. And yes. also we got to fast and pray and keep our mind stay on Him. Yes. Keep it on God. Yes. You can do it. We can do it. If we just trust in Him and believe and obey His word. Yeah. We can do it. Yes, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. Uh, we're going to go down to 9 and say, Now God brought Daniel into favor and tender love with the friend and the uh, enough. So Daniel, he was able to stand in the king's palace. Yes. Because he had knowledge, wisdom, and he could obey. I mean, he could understand the king's dream. He could understand, interpretate the king's dream. The king put him over everything because he was one of the children that that the king that the king picked out for the no the eunuch the unit picked out for the king yes, yes. was Daniel one of he caught the uh, he had the uh, prodigals and uh, all these people and the magician they couldn't tell him the his dream so Daniel he could tell the king's dream because he was worthy he was worthy. So, yes, he was. He was well favored. And he, could, and he had the ability to stand in the king's palace. And his friends, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, they did the same thing. They did not bow to the king's image. So they went on and praised God, lifted up his name. So we can be well faithful with God also. We just be obedient to yes. God's word. Yes. Just be obedient. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. So it says, um, say, but the devil, he desired to labor us. He desired to labor us. Yes, he does. But God will change the labor. Yes, he does. He will change it. Hallelujah. So, hallelujah. You. Just got to trust in God. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. Thank you. Hallelujah, Jesus. He is an awesome God. And it says, now, there's a scripture that says, now, this is the spirit of the Lord. Yes. And what the spirit of the Lord is, we have liberty. Yes. And liberty means free. Yes. We can be free. Yes. We've got to come out of that bondage and come into freedom. Hallelujah. Praise you in the name of Jesus. Thank you. <laughs>